All right, this week's breakdown, jab step. All right, let's break that down. All right, breaking down jab steps, right? So we did two separate jabs in that one. We did something called a front jab or a middle jab, and that's when you go step here. Okay, so when are we doing this? When a defender is crowding you and you're trying to get some space, put your leg, whichever jab step leg you're using, in my case, I'm right-handed, so I'm gonna use my right foot, but if you're a believer in a permanent pivot foot or two pivot feet, that's completely up to you and something you should work on individually. But for me, I'm right-handed. So if the defender's guarding me, his feet are gonna be in a stance, right? They're gonna be split. You're gonna take your jab foot and stick it right in between their legs like this. Now, you see how I'm wide. I'm not going like this because that wouldn't get the defender to back up. But I'm also not doing this to where I'm not on balance, right? So what you wanna do is you just wanna create space. So if I'm here, you just wanna step. And if you step in between someone's legs, they're naturally gonna back up, right? Just because of the fact that they really have no choice or you might draw a foul. If they try to stand there, you might be able to draw a foul. Now, when you do this, make sure you step and the ball is at your pocket. Don't have the ball in front, make sure it's behind. Now, when you step back, there's gonna be a brief period of time where you're gonna have some space. You could go and rip an attack, or you could do what I just did, and that's here, and now you're gonna side jab and get that defender maybe to try to jump and cut you off to bring it back and shoot it. Or you could jab step and take a cross step and attack the basket. So when we're working on the side jab, we want the ball, I always tell players, bring it hip to hip. So going like this, that's not a jab. You're not going anywhere without the ball, right? So we're here, bring that to your hip and your pocket, and then bring it back into your shooting stance. Okay, so you want ball movement and feet movement. Like they're, on to get, like they're added together on a string, not that. You want right away, low and tight, aggressive hard jab not to the side at an angle, simulating that drive. Fundamental footwork that every player needs.